Hey guys, welcome back to our modded Fallout 4 playthrough. So, we're gonna try and clean up some more quests today. It's driving me nuts having this giant list of quests. I know we're trying to do the Sim Settlement stuff, but let's try and get some others done too. So, we're gonna head over here. This one is for that key that we found. I think it's part of that uh, scavenger hunt or whatever. So I'm guessing something over here. Oh, hey, it's that truck that we found that I'd never seen before. Typhon's Note, huh? Let's see. Alright, let's see. Typhon's Note. Like, maybe you can give their friend some place to stay? Huh. Um, we're gonna go hit up the uh, Taking Sunshine Tidings right quick, because we're right here around the corner from it. So that should not take us too long to get to and do. Piper's gonna try and minigun those rad stags, I'm sure. Uh, we still need to get more ASAMs. Obviously, that's going to take time because the vendors only have like three or four at a time. And I have not found... Whoa. At a pet store? What the hell's a pet store? Yeah, anyways. I still haven't found any chalk to get freebies from the super mutant yet, so... For now, we'll just head over, we'll do Sunshine Tidings, and then we'll see what the next location we can get to is. Time to die! Uh-oh. Some individual just roaming around here? I'm missing something. Did I not see somebody just walking around randomly? Hmm. I don't see that person anymore. Not crazy, right? There was just somebody randomly walking around, right? Yeah, who knows? Alright, what's going on in here? Need to keep our eye out for Chalk, obviously.
That was stupid. I don't know why I couldn't hit that thing. You seem to be doing all right there, man. God's sake. Struggling with the rad roaches. cabin here. Didn't have a problem hitting that one. Sweet. Hello? Someone out there? Really? Gunfire somewhere. Okay. So once again, we'll need to set up. This place with ASAMs and stuff at a later date. Okay, so to talk to. Oh. The Winking Mole Rat. Okay. So we'll have to talk to Preston. We'll do that in sh some time or other. We got Final Locator can go down there. Glowing C. at this checkpoint so it should be fairly clear let's go ahead and go there and that way it's a short walk to the castle we can hang out down in that area and take care of a few small quests Thanks. You too. No, I, I didn't mean like... I could just use some help. This isn't the sort of thing I'd normally bother anyone else with, but you just seem really good with people, and I've got this issue with my sister, Nat, becoming me. All right. What's the issue? I'm just terrified she's going to start taking up like her big sis. I mean, think about the life we lead. No offense intended, Blue, but personal safety doesn't exactly seem like either of our strong suits. I can't have her ending up like her big sister. Dodging bullets and running from all the people she pisses off. It's part of the reason I'm on the road so much. Part of the reason I'm here with you. I keep thinking, maybe if I make myself scarce, if I'm not around her enough, she'll cool off. She'll just go back to being sweet, innocent Nat. Paper girl, an all-around upstanding citizen. What do I do, Blue? You just love her. Family's precious. The last thing you want to do is drive them away, because you might lose them forever. You're right. I can't risk that. Thanks, Blue. 
Who'd expect wandering off with a stranger to turn out this well? They really don't make them like you anymore. <laughs> You're a hell of a friend, you know that? Just friends, huh? But a friend for life. Or wow. at least as long as you don't start annoying me. But hey, thanks again for listening. It's a real weight off my chest to be able to talk it out with someone. So, you wanna hit the road? Holy crunkskies. Explosions and stuff going on everywhere. What the? What the? Oh. <laughs> Bad, bad, bad. Bad, bad, bad. This is an emergency message to all Commonwealth Army soldiers. Emergency protocol 17 Echo Charlie Niner are in effect. If you are in distress, please proceed to the South Boston Military Checkpoint Parade. Coordinates are available in your emergency handbook. This checkpoint has been designated as a safe house in case of enemy invasion, and is currently stocked with additional food, water, and ammunition. more recipes gotcha okay well with that being done there looks like we got some stuff over here to do it's like the CPD quest that we picked up a while back Bub, they're not here. Already gone off to beat down those gunners. Mr. Jared wants to meet you down at the docks back east. And then I have to stop talking or you'll never fucking get there, he says. So, I'm shutting up now. Have a ball. Bye. Okay. So now we have to go to the docks, wherever those are. Go 
Come on, load screen. There we go. Oh, it's not too far. It's just right over here. Slow on the uptake, Piper. Slow. Right, you piece of shit. Start talking or I'm gonna turn your head into a sieve. Hey. A fair trial? What are you? Just fucking talk. I will blow your fucking head off if you don't. I uh, don't think your boyfriend will like that. Brother. I'm her brother. And that sure doesn't make me someone who can stop her from shooting you. Guys, we got company. Hey, you over there. Get me out of this and there's caps in it for you. Shut it, you piece of shit. You. Who are you? And what are you doing here? I got your message. What do you want? Hey, it's okay. They're the one Caleb told us about. I kind of asked him along. Maybe someone else can explain why we're here while I rest and wait for that last stem pack to do its thing. Well, we're here to ensure that justice is done. These people are murderers, and we need more information. Tell me how I can help. We need her to give us the location of the rest of her unit. Then they can face justice for their crimes. Look, I can get it out of her. You just need to get out of my way and let me work. I'll talk to her. Maybe we can work this out. Are you fucking kidding me? Hey, I was here first! What makes you think you can do better than me? Lena, why not let them have a go? It can't hurt, and if she still isn't talking, you can have another try. Fine. She's all yours. Let's see what you can do. Yeah. What can you do? All right. Talk. I told you already. I'm telling you nothing. Hmm. What are you doing out here? Apart from getting my ass kicked and asked stupid questions? Not much. You? I... Well, uh, I got nothing. See? I knew they'd be useless. <sighs> I've had enough. I'm gonna go shoot the bitch and go home. Don't shoot! Don't shoot! I'll tell you about our leader. He's called the Butcher. Real psycho he is. Let us on raids, kills in all kinds of nasty ways. I can tell you where to find him. Gonna need some more information. Okay, more info. I can do that. Well, we called him the Butcher because of how he chops up his victims. We had to go long, or he'd chop us up too. He left us to set up as a raider. He's got a secret hideout that I can point you to if you're letting me go. Better kill him quickly, though. He's deadlier than he looks. And if you let him get close, he'll chop you up like all the others. I'm going to need more than that. Okay, okay, I'm doing that. I'll give you more. Like, uh, where the butcher set up his base. Shit! That wasn't me! It wasn't me! pockets but I won't hold my breath hey I'm really glad you chose to come I gotta sit down and get my breath back now I'll continue to help but you owe me an explanation first you're right we owe you at least that we're the Commonwealth Police Department well the beginnings of it we've got big plans though 
And those plans are first and foremost to get justice for what these animals did. Now everyone's had a rough day. Maybe we should get back to the station, where we can tell you all about what's going on. Explanations go better with a full belly, and not worrying about reinforcements coming over the ridge. We'll meet up at South Boston Police Station. I'll meet you there. Great. I'll look forward to it. Just maybe not as much as I'm longing for my bed. Bye for now. Yeah. Leave the poor old injured dude to fend for himself. Man, great, great teamwork there. Oh, we'll just trot along with them. Why not? to the police station, so let's see what they all want. Sorry, pal. Mouth shut till you go see Mr. Jared. Yeah, I'm gonna talk to you anyways, nice kid. Um, okay, well, let me wait, I guess. What's the deal here? Wasting valuable time. Roar. Dum dee dum dee dum dee dum. They're confused. They don't know what they're doing. Alright, fine. We'll, uh, come back and deal with them in a minute. Let's go over to the castle and talk to, uh... Go over to the castle and talk to Preston. That way we're at least getting stuff done.
There we go. I cleared out that spot you sent me to and set up a radio beacon there. That's great news. Once folks have some place to call their own, they'll be willing to help defend it. As usual, I have something else for you to look into. I'll mark it on your map. You can use all the support we can get. So see what you can do to help. Okay. Now where does he want us to go? I take Green Top Nursery though. Didn't we do Green Top? Thought we already opened that one up. are getting a little buggy here. That's not so good. Let's go see if we can do the CPD thing. Since that was a complete disaster. Santa Claus, who's asking? You been a good super mutant today? Eh, yeah, no. Gates. Why am I being defeated by a gate? Oh my goodness. Why they've set up in the most god awful part of the world, I don't know. Okay, have they all got their pathfinding sorted out? Can we get on with talking to people? Good word. Hi. Hi there. Welcome to our humble abode, headquarters of the Commonwealth Police Department. I'm Jared, by the way, or Sergeant Lund these days. Thanks for giving us a hand back there at the docks. From what Caleb has told us about you, I've been hoping we'd get to meet you. You probably have plenty of questions, or if you've the need, I can trade with you. So, is there anything I can help you with? Anything I can do to help out? Okay. There is something I think you can help me with if you're interested. There's an old police station which we'd like to get back up and running. And I'd like to get access to a pre-war stash, which should be there. The East Boston Station is being picked over by a nasty bunch of scavers. And I'd like someone to take care of them before they get into the stash. I suppose I can do that. Great. So evict those scavers and get the stash activated. Oh, and you'll need these old codes I got off the network. Uh... Hi. Hi there. I hear those scavs are still trying to get into East Boston Station stash. If we leave it too long, we'll lose out. How can I help you today? Let's trade. Great. Let me show you what's in stock. Okay. Okay. Why 
not. Besides, I got a bunch of junk I can dump anyways. Pleasure yeah, doing business good with you. Never know. Was there anything else? Um, no, thanks. Nope. Okay. Bye for now. Interesting. Hey. Hello, and welcome to the Commonwealth Police Department's headquarters. Oh, and I just wanted to say thank you for coming when Jared asked. Lena and me tend to get wrapped up in thinking we can do everything ourselves. Jared's the one who actually has a head for resources, whether that's keeping us fed, or knowing how many people to take to an engagement. Did you see that the Brotherhood has arrived? I read that they did good things in the Capital Wasteland. Let's hope they bring some order here, too. Can I help you with anything? Anything I can do to help out? Okay. Well, we need to corroborate the information given by the prisoner. Not that it's a lot to go on. It also showed that we need to build up if we want to take on people like the Hellhounds. Lena and Jared have some ideas you could maybe ask about. There was something I had in mind, too. It's a bit more academic than what the others will be thinking, but I'd like to hear what you think. Uh, go ahead. Okay. I'm listening. Thank you. The thing is, if we want the Commonwealth to respect us, we need to be seen upholding established laws. Well, I believe that if we are serious about presenting ourselves as police, we need to follow the old codes of law and order. I'm lucky enough to be well-read on old laws, but I think we all need to have books and tapes to reference and learn from. The Boston Public Library, I believe, will have what we need. Is there any chance that you'd be able to obtain some things for us? I'd be glad to help. Just tell me what you need. That's great. Here, I'll give you a list of the publications which I'm looking for. Uh, okay, back to the library for him. Hi. Oh, great. It's you again. And? You want something? Anything I can do to help out? You want to help us out? If you don't get in my way, there might be a few things you could do. Jared's our quartermaster, and he could always use help keeping us in bullets and caps. My little brother Simon probably has something very worthy he needs your help with. And for me, well, how do you feel about killing and skinning gunners? More than happy to stick it to the gunners. Good. Then you're really gonna like this. I'm putting bounties on gunners. Twenty-five caps ahead. Well, head tattoo. Only way of proving you've really put one down is to cut that tattoo off their forehead. And there's no nice way to do that. This isn't something for the faint-hearted or moral types. But you bring me those tats, and I'll give you the caps. Yeah. I'll do it. Great! I look forward to seeing what you bring me. Anything else? Nothing right now. Good. I have things to do. Hmm. Hey, no more messages for you yet. I hope we get something exciting soon. Interesting. Okay, so. We're gonna get stuff for Simon at the library. We'll have to go get that stash taken care of. Where is that stash, anyways? It's up there. Oh, I have to read his list. Doopy 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 doo. Uh. 
Okay. Looks like returning to Jake over there, a stash over here, various things like that. So why don't we do our level up and then I think we'll call it an episode there. Hmm. Hacker, science, or let's go with more pistol damage. Why not? Cool. Anyways, guys, I hope you enjoyed this episode, and I will catch you guys on the next one. Toodaloo!